So you guys all know what class this is, right? It's Lego physics. So we're gonna learn some physics, okay? But we're also gonna get to build things out of Lego. So who here's, who here's built things out of Legos? You guys haven't yet. Okay, well that's okay, and it doesn't matter. It's, it's perfectly okay. Before this class, I never actually played with Legos before. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna build a tower, the tallest tower you can out of these Legos. Mr. Steve, he knows a lot of math and science-y stuff. One of the great things about this Lego physics class is that while we're teaching the kids science, um, hopefully it's making it fun too. I learned it's kind of fun when you do it with friends. I like how we're just randomly putting colors in here. Working together makes the building go easier and way faster. Doing it hands-on, I think, is a much more effective way to really understand the concepts than just talking to them about it. Let's see, let's see how tall this is. What I'll do is, in the course of the class, introduce other concepts just to get them to think a little bit out of the box. If you build them this way, it's going to be really strong, but you won't be able to make it quite as tall as if you could turn them on their end. Just something to think about. And it's interesting to kind of see the spark in, in their minds where suddenly they see, oh, there's a different way to put these Legos together. I learned today, if you put strings on your towers, you can build them way taller. And then just go ahead down towards the floor. Rather than just building something out of Legos, they can actually start okay. to see some of the physics behind what they're building. Go ahead and push the peg through there. Right here? Okay. Yeah, and that'll hold the string in place so the string can't move. And then you guys are gonna tape this end down. Like there. Yeah, perfect. My group was awesome. And we built our tower really tall. Now since I learned all the steps, maybe when I grow up, I might be an engineer. I could help build real houses, but it wouldn't be as easy as using Legos. So which vocabulary word was for curved? Oh. Oh. Yeah, Elizabeth, what were you thinking? It's kind of like an arc. Arch, so that's an arch bridge, good. Saturday Academy classes provide an excellent opportunity to kids in schools like this that they might not otherwise have.